Hi friends! The DB function is used to calculate the depreciation of an asset for a specified period using the fixed declining balance method. Let's go ahead and see how you can use the DB function in Microsoft Excel. Open the desired Excel worksheet. Here for demo purpose, we are using a worksheet according to the DB function. Please check the web URL given in the video description below this video for complete details that is syntax and remarks. We are also showing the description of the function we're going to use here. To calculate depreciation in the first year with only seven months calculated, select the cell where you want to get the function's result. Type equals DB, open parentheses, select the cell that contains the initial cost, comma, select the cell that contains the salvage value, comma, Select the cell that contains the number of periods over which the asset is being depreciated, comma, type the period for which you want to calculate the depreciation, comma, type the number of months in the first year, close parentheses, and then press the Enter key. It will show the result. To calculate depreciation in the second year, select the cell where you want to get the function's result. Type equals DB, open parentheses, Select the cell that contains the initial cost, comma. Select the cell that contains the salvage value, comma. Select the cell that contains the number of periods over which the asset is being depreciated, comma. Type the period for which you want to calculate the depreciation, comma. Type the number of months in the first year, close parentheses, and then press the Enter key. It will show the result. To calculate depreciation in the third year, Select the cell where you want to get the function's result. Type equals DB, open parentheses, select the cell that contains the initial cost, comma, select the cell that contains the salvage value, comma, select the cell that contains the number of periods over which the asset is being depreciated, comma, type the period for which you want to calculate the depreciation, comma, type the number of months in the first year, close parentheses and then press the Enter key. It will show the result. To calculate depreciation in the fourth year, select the cell where you want to get the function's result. Type equals DB, open parentheses, select the cell that contains the initial cost, comma, select the cell that contains the salvage value, comma, select the cell that contains the number of periods over which the asset is being depreciated, comma, Type the period for which you want to calculate the depreciation, comma, type the number of months in the first year, close parentheses, and then press the Enter key. It will show the result. To calculate depreciation in the fifth year, select the cell where you want to get the function's result. Type equals DB, open parentheses, select the cell that contains the initial cost, comma, select the cell that contains the salvage value, comma, select the cell that contains the number of periods over which the asset is being depreciated, comma, type the period for which you want to calculate the depreciation, comma, type the number of months in the first year, close parentheses, and then press the Enter key. It will show the result. To calculate depreciation in the sixth year, select the cell where you want to get the function's result. Type equals DB open parentheses, select the cell that contains the initial cost, comma, select the cell that contains the salvage value, comma, select the cell that contains the number of periods over which the asset is being depreciated, comma, type the period for which you want to calculate the depreciation, comma, type the number of months in the first year, close parentheses, and then press the Enter key. It will show the result. To calculate depreciation in the seventh year with only five months calculated, select the cell where you want to get the function's result. Type equals DB, open parentheses, select the cell that contains the initial cost, comma, select the cell that contains the salvage value, comma, select the cell that contains the number of periods over which the asset is being depreciated, comma, 
Type the period for which you want to calculate the depreciation, comma, type the number of months in the first year, close parentheses, and then press the Enter key. It will show the result. Wasn't that easy? Have a nice day! For more details, click on the i icon on the top right of the video. Check out our iYogi channel for self-help videos on Windows, Mac, smartphones, security, social media, and much more. Have something to ask or share? Pen it down in the comments. To get iYogi tech support, dial toll-free numbers. To stay empowered technically, subscribe to our channel.